I used to go out and drink, watch TV and eat a pizza and wake up the next day and go back to work. But as I get older, it's important to me that I accomplish something. And I think that's one of the reasons I really like shooting trap. I, I think about work a lot. It doesn't matter to me whether I have the day off or whether I work, because I enjoy them both so much. So even though it's my day off, I still take calls from work if I need to. Are there almonds in this? No, all right, bye. <laughs> I take about an hour and a half long shower. I don't know why, it's just I've done it my whole life and it's like something I have to go through to like actually wake up. It's super weird. I eat breakfast when I'm on vacation. I don't eat breakfast otherwise. When I leave my place around 10, 10.30, there isn't much traffic. So it's, it's just a nice drive, I like it. I started trap shooting because I just had a lot of stress in my life and I needed like a hobby. My only hobby was cooking, which is my job, so it's not really a hobby. I just started shooting trap and all of a sudden I started feeling better. Like I'm out in nature doing this thing out in the sun and it feels good. Trap shooting, it's just a competitive clay pigeon sport. You have one solid house that throws the pigeons themselves you look right down the barrel, you call for the bird when you're ready, and you come right below it and squeeze the trigger. You're judging the direction of something and its velocity. Taking that deep breath, calling for the target, and coming up, taking it down, and repeating that again, and repeating that again and again and again until you've done it 25 times in a row. It's so far out of my mind that I'm shooting a gun that it's just like something I'm using to accomplish this game. After I shoot, I go get a sandwich at Angelo's over in Petaluma. I really love that place. It's just a really solid sandwich. They're made to order. I always get an Italian on a soft roll with what they call the works, lettuce, tomato, onion, mayonnaise, oil, and vinegar. I normally eat that with a bag of Doritos and a soda because if you're gonna go for it, you need to go for it, you know? After that, come back home, put a record on, have a beer cook for me and my wife for dinner. Some uh, dry aged ribeyes that have been aged for 21 days and a uh, big market salad. Butter, lettuce, dragon tongue beans, figs, turnips, radishes. I, I cook this dinner every other week. We'll watch a movie or watch TV or you know, John Oliver. She'll probably fall asleep on the couch and I'll probably fall asleep in my chair. Yeah, pretty boring life. <laughs>